Welcome. Thank you for using RMEC Teach, the award-winning whole class teaching and learning application. In this session, we are going to explore the splash screen. When we first start Easy Teach, the splash screen gives us six choices. We're going to explore them in a reverse order. EasyTeach.com is the official RM Easy Teach website. An important link on this website is RM Easy Learn. RM Easy Learn is an online space that you can regularly visit to download resources, get latest product updates, chat and share ideas with other users. You will have to register to be able to use the website. There are thousands of pre-made lessons categorized into various subjects. These lessons can be used as is in the classroom or they can be easily edited and customized to suit your need. My Easy Teach allows us to set our personal preferences. There are two tabs, multimedia and general settings. The US English is the default language. You can change the location where you want to save the Easy Teach files. The extension for Easy Teach is .etng. There are four page sizes. 4x3 is your standard projector, 16x9 is the HDTV format. 16 by 10 are the wide projectors. A4 is the paper size used all over the world except North America. I'm going to choose 16 by 10. Page can be oriented in a portrait or landscape format. I'm going to choose landscape. You can choose any font you want in whatever font size you prefer. The toolbars can be located at the bottom or at the top. If you invite students to the board and if your height is less than average, then you might want to choose the toolbar at the bottom. The drawing colors, we have two choices, the fill color. You have some standard colors or the black and white scale. You have a spectrum where you can choose any color you want or if you want no fill, you would select that icon. That's the outline color for your objects. That's where you choose your text color. In the outline color for your text box, I have chosen no outline color. In the multimedia settings, we have three choices. You choose the voice you want for your text-to-speech functionality in RM Easy Teach. Choose your recording device. In my case, it's a microphone attached to my laptop jack. And the video input device can be a video camera, a digital camera, or a document camera. I have two choices here. The USB 2.0 is the built-in camera in the laptop, and the eBeam Focus is the document camera I've attached to my laptop. You have to click OK so that your settings are preserved. Activities takes us to Easy Teach Samples folder. We have three choices, Daydream Education Wall Charts. These are interactive posters, excellent interactive posters, made by a company called Daydream Education Wall Charts. RM has included several of these wall charts for free in the software. The lessons, templates, and interactives are in two additional folders, English for the UK curriculum and US English for American curriculum. They are broken down by subjects, and once you explore that folder, you're gonna get your choice of interactives, lessons, and templates. Again, these are additional resources. They're free, they're included with the software, and they can be used as is, or they can be modified to suit your need. Recent documents gives us the five most recently used document. It's a quick access to your recent documents. Or the other choice is to open and browse for the folder to locate your document. When you click on new, it opens up a brand new Easy Teach document. That's all for this session. 
in the next session, the orientation session, we'll orient ourselves to this new document. Thank you very much.